Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. I'm Beaker. How we doing? What's up? Welcome back to the show. Today I want to show you guys something that I've been trying to not show you for the past couple days. The newest defense that's coming to Clash of Clans. It's the bomb tower. What's up, dude? It's directly from Clash Royale. They just like stole it from Clash Royale. They're like, hey, now we got a bomb tower. Cool. We're going to show you guys this thing in action today. And you know what's funny? In the past couple of videos I've done, this has been in the corner. Most of the time, it's been in the corner, just sort of hiding there, and I just didn't show it. It was so hard to not show it, dude. But here it is, the bomb tower. All right, guys, here we go. Let's test this out. I'm gonna do a friendly attack against this myself, pretty much, and we're gonna hit up these bomb towers. I just wanna see what these bomb towers can do against, like, a barb, for instance. Let's see it. What's up? <laughs> okay, so it's pretty good against barbarians. It's pretty good, probably, against archers, too. Let's see it. Oh my god. Okay, so it's like a wizard tower, except what about if it's up against two? Let's see that. <laughs> okay, so this crushes archers, obviously. Um, does it have splash damage? I, did, I didn't really notice that. Let's see. Yeah, obviously. Obviously it has splash damage too. Uh, let's see a goblin. Get it, get it. Oh! It missed! Okay, so it can't hit really fast moving drips. It's almost like a mortar then. I mean, if you could outrun it, it's kind of like a mortar. <laughs> That's so funny, dude. You, what? All right, what else can we do? I want to do a wall breaker. Let's see it. Get it? <laughs> okay, so the goblin is probably the only one that can outrun this thing. That's crazy, man. Uh, what else did we not do? Do we, do we do everything here? Yeah, I guess we pretty much did everything. So, okay. Oh, a wizard. Oh, we got to try a wizard. Let's try this. All right, dude. Get it. Oh, oh, this thing's crazy, man. <laughs> I mean, it does some good damage. It looks pretty sick. And here's the kicker. Here's the kicker. Who says, here's the kicker? Here's the kicker. When this thing dies, it blows up and it causes damage. So let's see that right now. Let's drop the giant on here and see how much damage it does when it explodes. Wait for it. Oh my, it turns into a bomb, dude. <laughs> I didn't know that. That was literally the first time I've seen that. I've not seen that yet. I kind I think that's great, dude. It turns into a giant bomb, right? It was just like a normal giant bomb. Let's do it again. Let's uh, let's drop another giant right here. <laughs> it's pretty sick. I don't know how much damage it does, but judging by how much it it hurt the giant, it looks like a couple hundred. That I think that did like two or three hundred damage. That was pretty sick. So anyway. Um, Cool, dude. Whoa, almost spilled my coffee. Cool, dude. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. This is definitely just straight from Clash Royale, but it's so different. Like, the fact that it blows up when it dies, that's pretty dope. And it's kind of like a mortar. It's just like a short-range mortar, you know? Anyway, let's try this again. All right, so I got some of the details right here on my phone, guys. Bomb Tower starting at Town Hall 8. That's pretty sick, man. Town Hall 8 and above, That that's pretty cool. And we know... When it dies, it explodes like a bomb, like a like a normal giant bomb, punishing masses of melee troops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get it. Cool. We get it. Bomb towers create a lot of new room for balancing mass attack troops. Okay. So they tried to make this bomb tower to go up against the bowler, I guess? Or the miner? Bowlers and miners, we hate you. Go away. <laughs> no, we don't hate you. We, we love you guys. Uh, also, I'm not sure if I'm able to say this right now, but it's right here. Which... Hit points massively increased. Damage increased as well. Let me repeat myself. Which massively increased. <laughs> the witch is getting buffed? What? I, I don't think I, I don't know if we can even talk about this right now, but if we can, I'm excited to tell you guys this because nobody's used witches in so long. It'd be pretty dope if we could use them again. I don't know. I mean, they're still gonna get blown up by bombs, I would assume. Who knows? Anyway. Oh my god, dude. The final thing on this list is insane. Giant bombs no longer deal extra damage to hogs. What? So basically, hogs are gonna own now. I mean, if the bombs don't do extra damage, it's a little easier. If you get your heels in the right spot, hogs are gonna crush. They're gonna be sick. Cool. All right, dudes. Cool. Let's run through this again. Let's check out the bomb tower again. And let me know what you guys think. I mean, this is a pretty small sneak peek, I guess. But it's something new. I mean, this is actually pretty cool as far as new things go. I would rather have something offense. I would rather have a troop. 
What am I saying? <laughs> I would way rather have that. But, you know, th this is something. Cool. Hey, guys, we didn't try a hog rider. Let's try a hog rider against uh, maybe each. Here we go. <laughs> oh, man. Are you serious, dude? Two hog riders just owned, just owned this. And the bomb didn't really do that much to the hog. <laughs> See what I mean? I mean, it killed it that time. But the bomb didn't, the first bomb didn't really do that much to the hog. I don't know, man. These things just got taken out pretty easily, but they're out on the edge, you know, they're not protected by anything. So we'll see. Let me know what you guys think about the bomb tower, about the other little things that we announced today. It's going to be pretty sick, man. If hogs come back and witches come back really hard. Cool. I'm for it. Yo, guys, I just thought, I just thought of something fun that I want to do today before we leave. I want to do 240 barbs up against the bomb towers. I want to see, like, is this even going to work? Are they all going to die? I, I have no idea. Let's try it out. <laughs> this is going to be so crazy, dude. No spells. Not going to use anything else. I'm just going to drop them all in one, one spot. Here we go. <laughs> this is going to be so crazy. All right. Let's get it. No way. No. Oh, my God. Are you serious? I mean, a wizard tower would do the same thing. But this just seems so much cooler, man. What are you? Are you serious? I'm only like halfway. I still have like 90 left. This is the craziest thing, dude. So, of course, normally you're not going to be doing that. Normally you're going to be, you know, you're going to have barbs spread out. Let's see what they do spread out. Okay. All right. So, yeah. I mean, you can easily overwhelm this thing if you have a couple troops spread out. Or if you have a hog rider or a giant. Like we showed earlier. But, dude, still... I mean, this is this is pretty fun. <laughs> I'm glad we did this. So, what do you guys think? Let me know. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I think this is cool, but I'm not a real big fan of having more defenses. I think we should just have more troops and heroes and fun, you know, just fun stuff like that. But anyway, let me know what you guys think. If you're into this, cool. I'm into it too. We'll be back soon for the rest of the stuff. Anything that's cool that comes out, we will be sure to show you guys. Stay tuned, and we'll see you guys then. Peace.